Hey, what's up, guys? Oh God, sorry. I don't. I don't know why I do that sometimes. <laughs> I'll just be sitting here thinking something's funny, and then it turns out not to be funny at all. But you know what? That's my life. But anyways, who gives a crap? What's going on, guys? Hope you're having a good day. So I don't know if you guys remember this or not, but in yesterday's video, I talked to you all about things that help us deal with anxiety. And I just want to point out really quick that everybody's different. Everyone is dealing with this quarantine and being in isolation in very different ways. So whatever works for somebody might not work for another. But these tips are what have helped me personally. So hopefully it might help you too. And then at the end of the video, I talked to you all how important it is to have deep connections with other people, especially during this time. In a way, I feel really grateful that we live in a time where we have the technology like we do today, where we have phones and computers where we can literally talk to people wherever. Like throughout history, obviously we've had to deal with pandemics a lot, but this is the first time ever that we have the technology we have today to help make these situations better and to have those deep connections with other people without actually seeing them face to face. When things get really difficult in life, it is so helpful, I've found, to have people in your life you can lean on for support. In my opinion, it's easier to go through these things when you have another person to talk to. So I don't ever want you to think that you have to hold the whole world's weight on your own shoulders. Listen, sometimes, not all the time, all you need is just to get the emotions out. So if you're feeling stressed, anxious, worried about a situation just talking to somebody else and venting about that can make you feel way better and sometimes when you just take a moment to listen to somebody you can even relate to them too which may help you feel better as well again all I'm saying is that it makes me personally feel really good to get all my emotions out that are bottled up so it might help you too and so let's say you're taking this downtime to be proactive and work on different goals whether it may be long-term or just a simple short-term goal it doesn't matter don't you think having a support group of people would just help that process and help you reach those goals because because like I've said before, Sam has always been that person for me with anything in life. It doesn't matter if we were talking girls, business, YouTube video ideas. I've always felt that I can just rely on Sam to be there and hold me accountable for stuff and it just helps me so much. You guys get the point though. Having deep connections with others is just a plus during this time. Listen, I know I've said this before in other videos, but I'm gonna say it again. If you cheat on a math test in high school, then you get in trouble. But you can cheat on anything in life except for your boyfriend or girlfriend. <laughs> if it helps, you can work together with anybody for anything. Again, I really, really wanna stress this. Everybody is different, but having deep connections with people can just really help during this time. Don't get me wrong, social media is great too. Like I'll go on Twitter and see people's posts and it makes me feel better, but it's not like having that deep connection I'm talking about with somebody. Like I said, I had a lot of things that I wanted to do in my life, but having Sam has made me accomplishing those goals so much easier because I have him to rely on. And since he's counting on me to do it, it makes me more motivated get it done and that's what helps me personally when I first started feeling worried about this whole COVID situation I had him right next to me to talk to explain how I was feeling listen to what he was saying and relate to it and therefore develop a deeper connection and a better feeling about the whole situation and guys I just really want to emphasize something really quick accomplishing and getting things done can mean a lot of different things too it could just mean focusing on yourself or setting goals to relax more it doesn't have to be work or something that makes you feel like oh I don't want to do that the goal of this is not to make you feel overwhelmed you should just be doing things at your own pace. But whatever it may be, just working toward yourself during this time would be so healthy for your mindset. I'm just gonna talk to you tomorrow how this is a great opportunity for you to make the changes in your life that you wanna make. And with the right support network of friends and a right mindset, you can do just that. And just as a reminder, we have that support network for you, which we'll talk about too. We're gonna tell you what worked for us. And now you can work with this current situation in a way that makes you feel like a better version of yourself. All of that in tomorrow's video. Talk to you soon. See you guys.